welcome back to my channel. Welcome to my channel if you're new here. Uh, first off, I want to apologize for the noise because we have the TV on, the iPad on, and there's noise in the background, but that's life, right? So, this is my first. I have to switch arms because I haven't vlogged in forever. But it's my first video since I announced my pregnancy. So today I'm actually 16 weeks and two days pregnant. Um, every Sunday I'm in a week. So yeah, I will do like a pregnancy update and get more into that and also why I haven't been filming. Um, just really just because of the pregnancy I've been really sick this time around. So it's been a lot harder and I've been a lot busier. And if you can't tell, I'm out of breath. Um, but you can already tell by the title. I have a grocery haul for you guys and you guys really seem to like those. So I wanted to go ahead and share with you guys a huge grocery, sh grocery shopping trip that I just did. I did it in store today. I didn't order pickup. So it took a lot longer than expected and I took Mason with me. So you can only imagine how that went. But let's just get on into the video. So nothing is really in like certain order. I mean, I kind of have it categorized, but just like an overview of everything I got. It's really quick. So we'll start from over here. I went to Aldi and stop and shop for everything. So first off, I have a three pound bag of white rice. This will last us a long time. Two boxes of ziti because they didn't have like penne or any other type of pasta really. They only had spaghetti, I think rigatoni and ziti. And this is, if they don't have penne, then I prefer ziti. So, um, three boxes of mac and cheese, some chocolate like cocoa rice cereal. It's um like Aldi's brand of like the chocolate rice krispies. I'm pretty sure. Some pancakes or pancake mix, syrup, um, barbecue sauce. Normally we get the Sweet Baby Rays. I think that's the brand, but Aldi didn't have it today. So I got their brand. Moving to the front, we have some maraschino cherries. Really, this is for Shirley Temples. And we have a new discovery that Mason loves these. So I got some of that for him. Pickles, because I mean, I'm pregnant. I've been craving pickles, and we're having burgers this week, so I really want pickles with that. We have just a can of corn. I think that's for a recipe. Some pasta sauce. I've been really sensitive to garlic this time around with the pregnancy. Um, so normally I get, like, tomato basil, garlic, something like that sauce, but today I just got this. So I don't think it has garlic, but we'll find out. I got some hot sauce. Or hot salsa um, for tacos. It's like what I like. Two cans of the fire roasted diced tomatoes for a recipe. Uh, chicken broth. This is actually basically all being used for a recipe. So we'll see how that turns out. Um, lots of the fruit and veggie pouches. Mason is not a huge vegetable kid as I'm sure most three-year-olds are. Um, so... This is the way that I try to incorporate some veggies so he gets carrots and then, you know, obviously fruit in there and he just thinks it's applesauce. So pretty good. Uh, Dino nuggets because we are out of those. And then turkey sausage. I don't really like the regular original sausage links. So I just get the turkey ones and they're good with our family. Mason eats them. Brandon eats them. I eat them. So it's all good. Some avocados. I just got a bag of the mini ones because I'm the only one that really eats this and they're like as hard as a rock So hopefully they're ripe in a few days We get some little mandarins Mason requested these however, he does not like them um, And I know he doesn't like them. We've tried to get him to eat oranges. He's just not a fan uh, But he eats lots of other fruits, so I don't really care. It's not a huge issue but Brandon will eat these, so that's good. These are actually Brandon's favorite. I got one little tomato for a recipe, I think. Um, a two-pound pack of strawberries, some bananas, 
the camera's making them look, I think, more yellow. But I buy my bananas green because literally tomorrow they'll be yellow and they'll go bad in like a day. Um, a bag of red onions. We have a bag of apples under there. Some red grapes. And then like random things. I got a pack of sponges. Some bleach and some Fabuloso. It's a multi-purpose cleaner so I just use that on the floor. And I'm going to try it on the counters. Normally I don't use that. Um, but I figured why not. I'll just try it and see how it goes. How I like it. And then some bell peppers for a recipe. And moving on to this side, we have like more little frozen stuff, beverages, bread, and produce, or like eggs. Um, so over here, this is like really random, but they were having a sale. We already have ice cream, but being pregnant, you can never have too much. So I got some chocolate eclair bars for myself, strawberry eclair bars for Brandon, and then just some chocolate fudge bars um, for all of us. Mason likes them too. Um, a box of mini brownies. These are like the Entenmann's Little Bites, but Aldi's brand, and they're a lot cheaper and they taste just the same. And then also some chocolate chip muffins too. Um, I got a bag of Simpsons French fries, just as a slide for our burgers, as a quick dinner or like a side dish for dinner. Um, they didn't have any ground beef at Aldi except for like ground sirloin, which I don't know. I've never really had ground sirloin before. I'm very picky when it comes to meat. I don't like a lot of it. I will literally just eat ground beef and chicken. Um, sometimes steak, but like I'm not, like I said, I'm very picky with meat. So this is literally the only type of meat that they had. Um, so I will use some of it for burgers. And some of it for our tacos, I guess. We'll see. I might have to go back to the store and grab more, which is fine. But I wanted to get something. Um, some beef patties. Another pregnancy craving of mine. I love these, actually. But definitely spicy food when I'm pregnant. I love it. And this has a little kick to it. So that. The fries. Um, we have chicken breasts. I will cut these in half. Um, like, half-wise, like, um, that, like, a butterfly, basically, like, butterfly them, except I'll cut them all the way through, if you get what I'm saying. I can't even describe it right now, but I will do that. So, instead of four chicken breasts, we'll actually get eight out of this pack, at least. So, that's really great. And then, underneath, I have a huge, um, Supreme Pizza from Aldi. This is literally, like huge if you can tell it goes back until here so it's that big and this will be a great lunch and even dinner for us um so we'll make it for dinner one night and then have leftovers and i can eat it for lunch the next day moving over here we have some tortillas i have um like I said, we're making tacos and then also barbecue chicken quesadillas this week. And I like to dip tortillas in salsa, hot salsa, like I showed you. Just as like a little thing to snack on. So, got those. Hamburger buns. Some bread. Some fudge striped cookies. Some mini Oreos. These are a little treat for Mason when he goes to school. Um, we have the Bentco boxes. So I just put a couple of mini Oreos and like the little mini uh, compartment in the middle and they fit perfect. Peanut butter chewy dipped chocolate bars, little granola bars, these are really good. Some fruit gushers, Mason saw them and requested them. I don't know if I like them but we'll see, Brandon likes them so just a little treat again. And then some fruit snacks. Um, Juice boxes. Normally, I don't give him juice boxes. I will give him his thermos. Oh, chocolate ice cream. <laughs> I have to put it away because it's going to melt. But he actually, I think it was the dog, honestly, because his thermos from school was on the couch. <laughs> sure, one second, okay? his thermos was on the couch from school and I think the dog jumped up on the couch and chewed it um, so I had to order him a straw replacement so this week he's getting 
some juice boxes until that comes in, which is actually on Thursday, so in two days. Um, so literally he'll just need two of them and the rest you can have at home. But I try to have him drink water as much as possible at school. So um, we also have some Coke, Sprite for Shirley Temples. It's caffeine free as well, which is good when you're pregnant and Dr. Pepper. We have eggs. Um, we have some white American cheese and salami for sandwiches. That was Brandon's only request for the grocery trip, so he got that. Uh, some heavy whipping cream or heavy cream for a recipe. I only need six ounces, I think, so I don't know. I'm going to have to find something to use the rest of that for. Little thing of I can't believe it's not butter. Some uh, orange juice. Oh my gosh, some orange juice. Has to be the no pulp kind. I do not like pulp. Now that it's Brandon. And then just a gallon of milk. And that is everything. This whole thing costs a little over $200. Um, which is pretty good, I think. Really all I do was like one twenty ish And then Stop and Shop, you guys. It's so expensive. The Stop and Shop stuff was $92. So yeah, that is everything for the week. Thank you guys so much for watching my video and I hope you guys subscribe and tune in for more videos. Definitely hope to get back into vlogging. I'm feeling a lot better like I said. So yeah, thank you guys, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.